Peace, everybody. This is part two of a series of three, I believe that it'll be. And it's pertaining to a book that Henry Harris Brown made and some writings that he has in an audio. And he's talking about Dollars Want Me. This is the title, Dollars Want Me, The New Road to Opulence. So I explained a couple of thought patterns and ways to talk when it pertains to money. But in this particular section or video, I'm going to talk about some of the desires, um, the magnet, magnetive uh, desires that you may have and something that attracts people to you if you have to have two things uh, two poles is which he used the terminology and he says first he says you have to have something that the world wants you know you're talking about the law of supply and demand you have to have something that the law that the world wants that they're willing to pay for do you have that something i believe i have that something and I've always asked you, and I put it out there, and you can see in all of the four, five, six hundred videos that I have out there, and the thousands of blogs that I have out there, that I'm always trying to show you that I have something for the world, and I believe that you should pay for it, and I, because I paid for it, and I believe that what I've learned to be able to go further with it is definitely has a value and a monetary value to it. Second of all, he basically says dedicate a lot of that money um, to noble service. And that's what I also do. I dedicate my money, I dedicate my time, and a lot of things like that to services or to people that may be in need. Um, and I know most people that I do, um, they call it philanthropy when you become wealthy. <laughs> we call it charity, you know, when you have not made it to the openly, physically wealthy part when you just have millions and millions they call it philanthropy but i have mil millions mentally and i'm one step closer to my first million so i'm right there on 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 the path just like you are and i want to help you get there so make sure that when you contact me and make sure when you join up that you put that information in there that this is what you want and we'll start the process of getting what you desire uh to come to you one of the things another thing that he mentioned um, Mr. Brown said, you can invite money and it'll come. And you treat it that way when it's powerless. You can invite it and it'll come. It says and they need your brain, your heart, and your hands to benefit the world. So what we're doing, what he's doing, if I'm reading this correctly and hearing it correctly, and you tell me, he's basically saying money is useless until somebody uses it. A human uses it, and that's when the value takes on and it circulates and it begins to pay things and money goes around and it comes back and you just use it as that form of exchange. But otherwise, it's nothing. And to think of it as nothing, you know, so here's something else. And I, I really like this. He said necessity drives man, um, his imagination and for ideals. OK, and with that, he says ideal leads to discovery. Love for the ideal leads to desire. Desire leads to action, and action converts that ideal to a final product, something tangible, something physical, something that you see. So it's a, it's a circle. It's an almighty circle that goes around, and it comes back to you. And so with that, I wanted to end it by just letting you know what he thought about, you know, uh, something else that he brought in there is that you learn how to get, man has to learn how to get what's desired. You have to learn how to get what's desired. Don't want. Stop wanting and start going after things that you desire. I really like the way this man thinks and the way he talks. So with that, this is Thomas Amal again with Conversation Corner. Remember, be smart. Think first. Think first. Be smart. In the meantime, think first and be smart by clicking that link below. Joining on. We have some here serious specials. If you get in now, you might be able to get in time to get to Charlotte to our next event, which is coming up in a few weeks, uh, a couple of weeks now. Uh, and we can see each other down there. Otherwise, get in, get all in, and we can go from there and, and start the destiny, your destiny or reaching your destiny. Thomas Small Conversation Corner. Talk to you soon. Peace. <laughs>